Hello from beautiful Naples, Florida, where the weather has turned around for the third round of the season-ending CME Group Tour Championship today. I'm Kelly Thaser, and I'm pleased to be joined by Beth Ann Nichols from Golf Week Magazine. Thanks so much for joining me here today. Thanks for having me. Beth Ann, yesterday in the second round, Michelle Wee really was the story of the day, shooting a solid round to put herself back up in the mix for not only the win this week, but yeah. also for the $1 million prize in the race to the CME Globe. How much does it mean to have Michelle now in the mix here this week? Well, anytime you have Michelle Wee, you know, on the board, it's it takes the tournament to a whole new level of interest for for casual golf fans. So, I think uh, I think it's the only perfect way the LPGA should end its season is to have <laughs> Michelle Wee, if not winning, at least in the in the ball game, so people are tuning in to see if she can get it done. I mean, three three victories in one season for Michelle Wee would tie Stacey Lewis and NB and, and be a huge way for her to go out. We've got a lot on the line this week, not just the $1 million prize, but the Player of the Year honors, Bear Trophy, mm -hmm. official money list title, so many things up for grabs here this week. Stacey Lewis has been a storyline, as you've said, Michelle Wee's been a storyline all year. What, which of these races do you think is the most interesting that's going on this week? Well, I think Stacey Lewis having the chance to sweep the postseason um, is the most significant thing because an American hasn't done it since 1993 and I think that 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 holds a lot of significance for this American based tour so uh, so I think that 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 would be the biggest storyline for me but you know I think Stacy could win all of those things and Michelle we could win the tournament separately uh, and the and the 1.5 million dollars and for me that would be the kind of the best of both worlds scenario in my perfect reporter world. <laughs> Lots to write about, no doubt about that. Well, today is moving day here at the CME Group Tour Championship. We saw Morgan Pressel shoot six under yesterday. Who do you see kind of moving out of the pack, and who could make a run today? Well, early today, Stacy Lewis got through that gauntlet of the first four holes, one under par, which is, you know, an improvement to say the least over yesterday. So, I think that if she gets the confidence going, uh, you know, if she makes a move today, it puts a lot of pressure on those players at the top of the board who have never won or haven't won in a very long time. So, uh, you know, I think it, uh, I think Lewis could really light it up today. Should be an exciting day here in Naples. Make sure to tune in to Golf Channel for live coverage from 1.30 until 4 p.m. today. And make sure to follow us all week long on LPGA.com. Thanks so much for tuning in.